I had the opportunity to intern at two different banks at that time, and then was determined to continue this path after my graduation. During my two-year rotation and training, I realized that I wanted to do something related to investment. And that was when I started my CFA charter journey. It really allowed me to gain hard knowledge on investment products. And I landed in the investment product team after my MT program. I am very happy to have started my career in the banking sector. As banks now encourage internal mobility, I had many opportunities to be exposed to different areas in the bank. It helped to show the management and peer that I am willing to go the extra miles to equip myself. Even though work is already overwhelming, I was willing to take the time and effort to invest in myself. I believe management appreciates employees who are curious, hardworking, and dedicated. During the COVID period, when you do not get to socialize much, I really do start to get fatigued. It was a difficult period for everyone. And it was also at that time that I started engaging more activities organized by CFA Society Hong Kong. It all started online. And then gradually we met over different events. There's a saying that you will be the same person after five years, except for the books you have read and people you have met. For example, I joined the book club whereby every quarter we will come together to discuss on a book. And recently, I started arranging some lifestyle events for the society members. The first one being chocolate tasting. It was fun to taste chocolate, listen to the startup stories from the owners themselves, and at the same time, network with fellow CFA charter holders. It was fun to interact directly with the owners on how they select their cacao beans, import them, turn them into chocolate, and also learn about their future expansion plans. This is what I call educational and fun.